comedian Sebastian Maniscalco. Thanks for being here. Oh, thanks for having me. On the couch, this is great. <laughs> That's nice. Yeah, that's nice. You're easy to please. Yeah, that's We allowed you to sit down and you're happy about I'm it. I'm telling you, this is my first panel ever, so thank you for oh, really? me on the Oh, really? The first time you sat down on a talk show? Yeah! Wow, okay. Well, I, here's my first question. Here's my first question for you on a talk show ever is that you're from a traditional Irish, uh, Italian family, right? I am. How did your parents feel about you going into comedy? Because this is a risky thing to do with your life. It is risky, but my mother, when I was nine, came home and she's like, Get dressed in a nice suit. Um, we're going to the mall. I put you into a modeling competition. <laughs> so I'm like, what? She's like, get in the basement. We're going to do a skit. We're going to teach you how to walk down a runway to Eye of the Tiger. They were a big Sylvester Stallone oh, fans? Yeah, of course. I had the Rocky poster, the whole thing. So I go out. And uh, we're doing the rehearsals, you know, I had the punches, I was doing, you know, lapel moves. So we go to Woodfield Mall. Uh, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, you know, Woodfield. Quality place, yeah. yeah Chicago, yeah. northwest suburbs. So we go, right? We go to the mall, cue up the Rocky, no Rocky. I gotta go out, no music. And I wow. still won. <laughs> Congratulations. What do, you, what, do you, what do you win at nine years old? I won the, uh, I don't know what, I, what they gave me. Um, I think I just stole the jacket they uh, let me model. You call yourself behavioral police. What do you mean by that? Well, listen, I got, uh, I just went over to this couple's house yeah. and uh, they asked me to take uh, my shoes off. And I didn't even know the couple. And I'm is sorry. Is that like you... what, nice carpet or something? What is it? Well, it's like, I'm 43 years old. The shoes don't come off until I go back to where I put them on. <laughs> right? Once a man loses his shoes, his night's done. So now I'm walking around a stranger's house meeting other grown men in their socks. <laughs> hey, everybody's in like a sock circle. One guy came up, he was barefoot. I almost threw up in my mouth. <laughs> the guy was barefoot, he wanted to talk serious topics. He's like, what do you think of ISIS? I said, what do you think about putting some socks on? <laughs> ISIS is the least of your concerns. Did they say why? Did they say why no shoes? They just take your shoes off? I think you should have had white carpeting. Okay, right? there it is. Yeah, sure. My question sure. is... Deep pile shack. Yeah, why, why, why you got white carpeting? <laughs> 2016, still? Those are people without children. They did. They had a, they had a kid. They oh, had really? a kid. And really? I guess they were concerned that I was going to traipse in... Yeah. You know, the, 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 the whatever. But I'm like, how do you know how clean my socks are? <laughs> well, thank you so much for being here. <laughs> Tickets to the Why Would You Do That Tour are available now on SebastianLive.com. Hey, special is on Showtime. Sebastian Maniscalco, everybody. We'll be right back.